Hey, I'm Brendan Fitzgerald. This is the Seaville Minute. Um, the sweater vest is here because fall is upon us. So here's what to do with this lovely fall weekend, uh, starting with Friday night. Christian Breeden's been playing around town a bit more often the last few months, and his uh, live act now has a band name, uh, Dirty Horse. And they're playing at the Cantina on Friday night. It's on Ellywood Avenue. Uh, they've also got Toon Yards and Nellie Kate at the T-Bazaar. Toon Yards are here visiting. Um, kind of twee, should be a lot of fun. Very sweet. Uh, and Nellie Kate, we really dig her. So uh, that's at the T-Bazaar on Friday night. Um, Othello is at Four County Players. And if you really, really want to make your arts editor feel just fantastic, he'll go uh, check out Othello at Four County Players. The director, Clinton Johnson. Um, and Nick Nichols is giving a talk uh, at the Paramount Theater. We think it has something to do with that enormous tree that is depicted on the downtown mall, uh, the large picture hanging on the uh, Market Street parking garage. So take a look at the photo. Go check it out. Uh, Saturday, uh, Bob Gerard and the Gladstones are throwing one of their classic hurricane parties at Del Rio. Um, I've also got the Raquelos celebrating the release of their new album at the Tea Bazaar. Um, and Titus Andronicus is back in town playing with the Drunk Tigers at the Southern. So uh, I think I'll be at the last two, but someone go to go to the hurricane party, let me know how it is. Um, Sunday, uh, David Cook, the American Idol winner. No runners up here. It's at the Paramount. And also uh, Valleys, nice indie folk act, is playing at Random Row Books, which is that spot right near the Lewis and Clark statue on West Main, uh, just opened. So go check it out. See you next week.